हेलो फ्रेंड वेलकम बैक रिसेंटली वी हैव एडेड कपल ऑफ न्यू फीचर इन टेस्ट केस स्टूडियो प्रो विच विल इंक्रीज योर प्रोडक्टिविटी वाइल यूजिंग दी टेस्ट केस स्टूडियो प्रो वर्जन सो द वेरी फर्स्ट वन इज कॉपी स्क्रीन शॉट शॉर्टकट सो वी ऑलरेडी हैव एन ऑप्शन टू कॉपी दी स्क्रीन शॉट इन टेस्ट केस स्टूडियो प्रो फ्रॉम फॉर एन एग्जाम्पल हेयर यू सी लाइक यू कैन जस्ट ऑन एनी स्क्रीन शॉट यू कूड डू राइट क्लिक एंड कॉपी दिस इमेज राइट बट समाइम्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लाइक देर इज अफर्ट लाइक यू हैव टू राइट क्लिक देन कॉपी इमेज एंड देन ऑफकोर्स यू कैन पेस्ट इट सो टू स्टॉप टू स्टेप्स आर इन्वॉल्व देयर अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट इन मैनी मैनी टाइम्स इन विंडो सिस्टम लाइक टेन और इलेवन और डिफरेंट इफ यू हैव सम काइंड ऑफ सपोर्ट इन ऑल दिस वर्क दिस माइट नॉट वर्क सो टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फॉर फॉर एवर बिकॉज इन विंडोज वॉट हैपन समटाइम्स वैन यू कॉपी इमेज इट यू माइट बी एबल टू पेस्ट इट इन डॉक्यूमेंट इन योर लोकल डॉक्यूमेंट बट यू माइट नॉट बी एबल टू पेस्ट इट इन गूगल डॉक ऑनलाइन डॉक्यूमेंट और इन एनी चैट विंडो सो टू सॉल्व ऑल दैट प्रॉब्लम फॉर फॉर एवर वी हैव इंट्रोड्यूस दिस कॉपी बटन हेयर सो वेन एवर यू विल होवर ऑन एनी स्क्रीन शॉट यू सी दैट अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस सेलेक्ट यू हैव नाउ दिस कॉपी स्क्रीन शॉट सो वॉट यू कैन डू यू कैन सिंपली कॉपी क्लिक ऑन कॉपी आइकन हेयर एंड द screenshot got copied in your clipboard now you can paste it anywhere in your chat or in your document or or wherever you want like for an example let's say this is a document here and you can paste it in any chat window you can paste it anywhere you can paste it so this will help you guys a lot to copy the screenshot now just in one click you need not to right click and then move your mouse up and down for copy image and like uh, because you see that when you right click then you have to read all these options where is that copy image button and then you have to copy so this is going to solve that problem and now it it will be working on mac windows on all the operating system as well as like you will be able to paste that copy uh, screenshot in your chat window in your uh, document online offline in your local system anyway so this is the copy screenshot shortcut option this is suggested by one of our community member in hyderabad selectors of meetup so please suggesting these features we will always be happy to add them now we have added the hide and show option in for for the footer button here so you see that lots of buttons are here so some of you might not be using some of the buttons ever so why to see all these buttons here and just have those button which you need so now you have the option which you uh, like under customize just go to customize we have lot many options here so you have the option let's say you don't want to you don't download pdf ever you don't download docs ever you don't uh, like uh, you don't want the save and continue something like that let's say for an example so in that case now you just have only the buttons which you need it so we have removed uh, we have given the option and if you ever want like all these buttons so you just keep it like this okay first step with url we have added another great feature here so you see that generally like when you were recording the test cases we were having the step like open website okay so open website and then url we were having the separate column so when you are downloading the excel sheet with all these columns that time it is fine okay this open website and then this is the url then whatever uh, for every step there is a url okay this is fine when you download but in some uh, like in some cases what happens like people used to customize the template like they hide the url column so now open website now which url you want to open of course data column is there so from the data you can take it okay so let's say we don't have the data column as well we have hidden that so now open website now where is the which website you want to open so and also like when you upload this test case test case on azure or test rail or whichever platform you are using for an example here like we have this azure zira or test rail so so in whichever platform you will be uploading this particular test case the steps used to go like this let's say op step open website and now which is that website so url was not there because it used to just upload the test step so now we have added option like not option we you will be getting the first step with the url so you can see that open website and it will be having that url which url so going forward when you will be uploading the test case like let's say uh here if i show you 
so going forward when you will be uploading the test case it will be coming with the url so it will be having like a step like open website and there will be url so for the with the first step where it will be having the open website it there will be url so now it will be more meaningful when you will be uploading the test case in any test management tool or if you are having any customized template so there will be url the fourth step is test trigger execute button fourth uh, sorry fourth feature we have added is test trigger execute button now it was there in the free version earlier now we have included in the pro version as well so if somebody wants to execute their test case on test trigger right from the test case uh, studio so what you can do you just click on execute button and it will uh, give uh, like it will pass all these steps to test trigger and test uh, you will be able to execute the test case on test trigger tool so they will be able to execute this test case and generate this script so you can see that it is started and your test case is being executed so yes of course like when you will be doing this the your all the steps will go to test trigger so if you want to execute and you want to explore more about like a tool which is going to generate the automation script auto healing and lot more things then you can of, of course explore test trigger from right from the test case studio pro from here itself you just click on execute button it will uh, combine all these steps send it to test trigger and test trigger will execute them and generate the script and again and again you can run so that's the button here and of course like if you want to uh, like uh, customize these button you have the option under uh, con config customize here and you can customize them so this is the uh, these all are the features which we have added copy screenshot shortcut hide and show footer buttons first step with url and test trigger execute button if you need any other feature if you have any suggestion feel free to let us in the comment section or you can write us uh, write to us at support at selectorsub.com and we will be happy to add all those features hope you are enjoying test cases studio pro if you haven't tried give it a uh, try take a free trial you can go to selectors sub website here you can check out all the plans and everything and this is very very helpful With that thank you thank you so much please like this video and subscribe to the channel also check out these awesome informative videos and keep watching more videos on Selector Sub channel. Thank you.